My name is Craig Lefevre. Uh, I'm an engineer here at uh, East High School. My name is Brian Scott. I'm the building engineer here at Wichita South High School. We maintain the, the swim pool, check the chemicals. Uh, we change filters, fix faucets to working on chillers if a chiller's down. Uh, get that back up going. Our building engineers cover uh, a wide variety of jobs here at the school. Uh, your building uh, consists of many uh, electrical, plumbing, uh, mechanical, uh, and building control uh, mechanisms here in the building. Um, we cover all of those. Yeah, I'll be a few minutes before I get down there. Originally, I come in, check my emails. Uh, I check the building controls make sure all the heating air and cooling temps are, are comfortable for all the teachers. Uh, I do the uh, pool chemical checks, and then I do my walk through through the whole building. And then I go on to do my work orders that I have uh, through the, the AIM work order system. I also, between all of that, I also do the emergency calls. I'm there, just right there, to go and fix it. Usually a blind maybe is broken in a classroom, pencil sharpener is broken in the classroom. They might have a light out in their classroom. They might have an issue with their clock. Um, these are all things that I try to get in right before eight o'clock before they're starting their classroom so I don't disrupt the classroom. Throughout the day it's it's radio calls, you know, non-stop radio calls. They'll be Usually uh, a toilet or something that backs up right away. There'll be a door lock that doesn't work correctly. Uh, there'll be an issue with a football on the roof or a soccer ball on the roof that I have to go and retrieve. Um, something that I guess that is enjoyable about my job is I never know what, what to expect here. Okay, yeah, I, I think I've got these coach. All right, okay. awesome. There's a broken water pipe somewhere, you've got an electrical problem somewhere, you have somebody in the building right away to get the water shut off, to get the power shut off to a certain area. Just such a, such a huge building with so many working parts that go on to it. If someone's here, you know, pretty much 24-7, uh, they know the building. You know, this building's been here since 1923. Uh, and so if you get familiar, it's just a lot easier to maintain it. We do use the service center uh, for bigger jobs, um, but we at least are able to diagnose the problem here on site and request any help that we may need. I've learned a lot. You know, there's always something else that I learn uh, throughout the day. If there's something that, that I'm not familiar with, that's when I, I put in a work order and have the service center, you know, and an electrician will come out or a plumber will come out or a guy with mechanical systems will come out and they'll really work with me and, and show me, you know, how, you know, how to fix the problem so next time I, I don't have to use them. I love this position. I like to uh, stay active with stuff. You know, it's always something, something different. I enjoy working in, in my old high school. It's really, uh, that's something that's neat. Not a lot of people get to work in their, in their former school. So I'd, I still see some of the teachers that were here 20 years ago when I was here and see pictures on the wall and old trophy cases from when I was here. So that's, that's a really unique experience. I think this is probably the best place in Wichita to work at. Uh, I just feel very welcome. The faculty staff is very nice. I just like the history of the school too. It being built in 1923. It's fantastic and just keep on getting this building to where it needs to be. You know, it's just a great place to work.